What's up Disney Infiniteers? Today I want to give you a guide on how to get three gold stars on Flight Path. This is one of the hardest missions in the game to get three gold stars on, and to do so you have to keep up with Bane's airspeeder, complete as Obi-Wan Kenobi, and complete without hitting any obstacles. Now the third part to this, complete without hitting any obstacles, is by far the most difficult thing in the game, in my opinion. So you can't hit any walls, you can't hit any air speeders, and you cannot hit any capsules. So without further ado, here's my guide on how to complete this. First thing is first, put this on extreme difficulty. If you get hit by anything, you can simply run into the wall, and this will restart the mission automatically, giving you a fresh start at not hitting anything. So all these objects, all these obstacles, you're going to want to weave back and forth. I like to stay to the lower left, and you'll see the constant theme of this level is staying to the left. A little bit of weaving right here, and then once you get out of this area, he's going to fire some shots, simply go high, and then right here is the hardest part of the mission, in my opinion. You will do an automatic left turn to try to stay low into the middle so you avoid all this oncoming traffic. From here, Again, you're going to want to stay to the left and right in the middle. You'll see some airships flying towards you on the top and the bottom. You want to stay right there, snub in the middle, and you will avoid all of this traffic. Then when you get to this part, you'll see some bigger ships. Simply lower yourself and raise yourself up and down. If you need to, to avoid some of this, he will lay some mines out, so avoid those. And then, voila, you're back to this area. Now, do not pick up any capsules. I had to find out the hard way that if you do pick out pick up any capsules it actually counts against you as hitting an object so make sure to avoid those right here you're going to want to stay low and then you will be going in the same direction as the traffic so stay high stay to the left and you'll avoid all of this next part veering off to the right this will be a little bit tricky but all you have to do is stay high now here's some capsules make sure you avoid those and then come back left and in the upper left quadrant this will keep you high enough to avoid his fire and all of his mines that he lays out. And that's pretty much the first part, and that's the hardest part of this mission. So once you get to this part, you're pretty much in the clear. There's only one more part in this entire level that you can really get hit on. Uh, but for the most part, it's going to be simply just staying to the left and high. So after that cutscene there, you will continue on and this is where he will lay some mines make sure you avoid that capsule there and stay like i mentioned to the left now when you get to this part with the traffic you want to go right smack dab in the middle just above the capsule and come back up and left and that is pretty much all she wrote once you get to this point you are pretty much in the clear except for this oncoming traffic right here so you're gonna have to dip down and come right back up in front of that ship because that will be in your way if you're staying in the upper left quadrant but once you surpass that ship you are simply in the clear and you are free to roam the skies and finish out this mission so like i said this is one of the toughest missions to get three gold stars on but a little bit of practice and hopefully this guide will show you how easy it is once you get adjusted to this level so i hope this guide helped you guys if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a like and subscribe for all the latest disney infinity news and content